Welcome to the concert. We will start the Revelation Praise 20th anniversary concert of Kohitsuji no Mure. This is the 20th year after we first received the Revelation Praise. To commemorate the 20th anniversary, I wished to have the Revelation concert. In the beginning of this year, the new praises, grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, come Lord Jesus, and amen of come Lord Jesus were given as if falling from the sky. It triggered my wish for the concert, for I felt God desiring the revelation praise at this time. We wish more than anything to respond to the will of God who entrusts praises to us. And I believe that holding the concert itself does the work for his will to be done. It was around one o'clock in the morning on January 16th in the year of 2000 when the first revelation praise was given to us. Our office was then located in an apartment complex called Ersha in Nishinomiya, Japan. Although it was almost midnight, several staff workers were still working there. Before leaving the office, I chatted with Naomi Hiraoka, nicknamed Karo, who returned to heaven in 2008. I casually said, I wish for a praise of Hori, Hori, Hori from the Revelation chapter 4. Who could have imagined that such an utterance would lead to the arrival of a new praise? After coming home past midnight, I was taking a bath when all of a sudden, utterly out of the blue, a melody popped out of my mouth. In surprise, I thought I had to record this melody. I had no IC recorder like I do now, nor tape recorder nearby. Then, an answering machine in my office came to mind, and I left the melody in it before forgetting. The following day after Sunday service, the recorded melody was taken into music notation by a staff worker, Manae Yamasaki. This was the praise Hori Alleluia, which became our first revelation praise. Although I had said, I wish for a praise of Hori, Hori, Hori. I did not recognize that this was the answer, much less remember that I had said it. On that night of January 16th, we sang this praise, Hori Alleluia, together with the staff workers who remained in the office. Since it was an easy to remember tune, everyone caught it at once and we kept on singing. After some time, the praise somehow ceased. It had just turned into January 17th, which was the fifth anniversary of the great Hanshin earthquake. We kept singing it for at least an hour, but incredibly, the next morning, not one person was able to recall the praise. Following Holy Alleluia, praises were given one after another every day. In this 20th year, we receive praises one after another, just like those days. The total number of praises taken into music notation is 
2,103 as of today, of which 134 are from the Book of Revelation. Other than the Revelation, praises are given from various books such as Psalms, Isaiah, and the Gospels, as well as nature, like flowers and winds. They are called heavenly praise. There is one thing I discovered, having received heavenly praise. All things have their own resounding, not only the scriptures and beautiful flowers, but also anger, sadness, pain, and sin. I believe it is because all things are created by the resounding sound, which is the word that was in the beginning. Created by the word of God, all things are indeed praise, and they all are beautiful. Anger and sorrow too are beautiful when they become praise, for they are turned to the praise itself. The most recent praise is a series of blood of the Lord. In praising the blood of the Lord, we are witnessing the power of praising and pleading the blood with one accord and with one voice. The blood is the power of prayer in the body of Christ. Facing the coronavirus pandemic this year, people and the earth are in great pain. Some experts also say that massive earthquakes can happen here in Japan anytime, even tomorrow. We, the people of praise, are entrusted with the big task. We give praise and prayer with one mind and with one voice. I cannot help but feel that it is for this present time that many praises have been given to us since the year 2000. All creation return to Christ and praise him. Here you will see the will of God done, who sent his son to the world. In 1993, when the first sanctuary of Koshitsuji no Mure, the Asia Church, was given. The Lord spoke to us in the opening service. Everything is completed in praise, and the faith in praise was bestowed. In 2000, the revelation praise started, and our eyes have been gradually opened to new worship, that is, heavenly worship, the worship in spirit and truth. God spoke to us. Give praise, becoming the four living creatures, you who are called to heavenly worship. I have entrusted my love to you. Praise is the sign that my love is eternal. Nothing is impossible with the perfect love, for it is the love that is revealed in the midst of the worship in spirit and truth. In 2008, the Church of the Wind was given to us. Since my encounter with the Lord, he had kept telling me for years, I am waiting. After 20 years, I realized that what he was waiting for was the Church of the Wind. To be precise, he was waiting for the worship fulfilled through the Church of the Wind. God spoke to us. I have been waiting for the time and the place for those in heaven to worship together with those on the earth. Heaven and earth worship together. I believe God has been showing us that his plan shall be accomplished on the whole earth when heaven and earth worship as one. 
The Bible says, In all wisdom and insight, he made known to us the mystery of his will, according to his kind intention, which he purposed in him with a view to an administration suitable to the fullness of the times, that is, the summing up of all things in Christ, things in the heavens and things on the earth. Ephesians chapter 1, verses 8 to 10. The time has come for all creation to worship together. Pastor Peter calls the worship of all creation cosmic worship. I believe that the praise is the core of cosmic worship and its center is the multidimensional praise. The multidimensional praise is the resounding of different phrases sung together and I see it emerge with a new resounding when the praise reaches a certain height. It is a new song. In this concert, we have multidimensional praises in which two to five versions, or twelve at most, are sung together. Rather than focusing on each of the melodies overlapping or following, I hope you will listen to a new song in the entirety of the harmony. And you will find the resonance of multidimensional praise manifesting the presence of the Lord. The presence of the invisible God fills the sanctuary and envelops all of us as if we could touch it with our hands. We have heard so many people testify, I was healed just being in the resounding, for the resonance is overflowing with his love and manifesting his peace. We praise the redeeming love of the cross of Christ. When the worship before the throne permeates the whole universe, cosmic worship will be accomplished in its literal sense, for the entire earth will become worship itself. May the love, peace, and healing of God be done on the earth. May the joy of God fill heaven and earth through the praise. Now the choir will come on stage. First, we will sing Revelation of Jesus Christ from the book of Revelation, chapter 1, which begins with the words, The Revelation of Jesus Christ. Revelation means that what has been hidden is unveiled and made visible. Jesus Christ reveals himself, and it means that what God desired in him is manifested and realized. The revelation of Jesus Christ, such simple and short words speak everything. The love of Christ is done. His redemption is completed. His peace is accomplished. And his healing is sent forth. Before and after the praise, revelation of Jesus Christ, the voices calling his name, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, come in. These are the praises, Jesus Christ, versions one and two, given for this concert. Heaven 
must be overflowing with praises to exalt his name. And I believe they have been resonating ever since the time of creation. We already have the praise, Jesus Christ, my God, which I feel has the same origin. Starting with Jesus Christ, we will sing revelation of Jesus Christ and amen to God, who is the Alpha and the Omega. And at the end, enter multidimensional praise. You will find the presence of the Lord in the divine resounding. Revelation of Jesus Christ. Thank you. 
Next, we will sing Holy Alleluia. This comes from Revelation chapter 4, verses 6 to 8. In the center and around the throne, four living creatures, day and night, they do not cease to say, Holy, Holy, Holy is the Lord God, the Almighty, who was and who is and who is to come. It is 20 years since we were given the first revelation praise, Holy Alleluia. Ten Japanese virgins have been born so far, and for this concert, virgins 11 and 12 were given, including Latin, English, Greek, Spanish, and Hawaiian virgins, now there are 25 versions of Holy Alleluia, which accounts for about one-fifth of all the revelation praises. In the center and around the throne, 
The four living creatures praise God day and night without ceasing. As some English translation says, they are exclaiming. I imagine the resounding of their praise is extraordinarily deep to such an extent. Holy Alleluia, the first praise given to us, must be the ultimate of praise desired by God. Holy Alleluia is the praise to the one who sits on the throne, so it is filled with the awe of God. But in this concert, we wish to sing the joy of praising the one who sits on the throne. We pray that praise may spread and flow to all the earth and to the entire universe, for we believe that the time of cosmic worship has come. The first voice of Holy Alleluia 11 will be followed by 2 and 12, one after another, and we will sing from 1 through 10, entering multidimensional praise at the end. We, as four living creatures, give praise to the one who sits on the throne and the Lamb. Please enjoy the resounding of Holy Alleluia spreading out to heaven and to the entire universe. Holy Alleluia. <laughs>
Song of Four Living Creatures. This comes from Revelation chapter 4, verse 6 to 9. And before the throne, there was something like a sea of glass, like crystal. And in the center and around the throne, four living creatures full of eyes in front and behind. The first creature was like a lion, and the second creature like a calf. And the third creature had a face like that of a man. And the fourth creature was like a flying eagle. And the four living creatures, each one of them having six wings, are full of eyes around and within. The living creatures give glory and honor and thanks to him who sits on the throne, to him who lives forever and ever. The Mysterious looking for living creatures place God in the center and around the throne, representing all creation as the existence of praise. God spoke to us in 2007. You do not just praise together with the four living creatures. You will be made the four living creatures. You, who are called to heavenly worship, give praise, becoming the four living creatures. At the time, I did not understand what they really meant and took it that we should praise the Lord, becoming one with the four living creatures, though still now I do not understand it quite well. The four living creatures are praise itself. Without praising, they would not be alive nor exist. Their existence itself is praise. Whatever they do, crying or exclaiming, it is all praise. By just existing, they accomplish the will of God. I believe that is why their bodies are covered with eyes. Their eyes are to turn all things to praise. Give praise, becoming the four living creatures. This, I now believe, tells us to become the very praise of the four living creatures. We no longer praise for our own sake, nor for others, but we praise only for God. Transcending our emotions, we worship him in spirit and truth, which I believe means that we become the praise for the sake of all things. Strangely, ever since receiving the praise song of four living creatures, I have felt that it was given to call people into the joy of praise. The four living creatures must be wishing us to know the joy of worship. It may be the Lord's desire entrusted to them. We will first sing Alleluia of the four living creatures, then song of four living creatures, and at the end, enter multi-dimensional praise, starting with Amen of the four living creatures. May the joy of praise abound in the church of the wind and in each of you. Song of four living creatures. <laughs> 